Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new. It is time for the big grocery haul of the month. We are starting off with Sam's Club and then we will go ahead and do Walmart and I'm really excited to be bringing you guys this grocery haul. We do one big grocery haul month and then little ones throughout. This is part of the big one from Sam's Club and let's just dive into it. Taking a step back, here is everything. Starting off, we have Danimals. I always put these upside down, my Lanta. We have Danimals for the kids and we have two three pound bunches of bananas. My kids love bananas. We go through them like crazy. Um, this one, these ones will be yellow soon. Soon, I imagine, soon. So we have two bunches of bananas. Great deal to get them from there. These chicken bites, Zach really likes these, and so I got these for him, and I think they are three pound chicken bites. Diet Pepsi for Zach, he really likes his Diet Pepsi. Uh, waffles, and these are for Maverick, he loves these waffles. I tried to trick him one time making like my own like this, and no, he just does not have it. Two big bags of chicken nuggets. Uh, I don't plan on buying chicken nuggets anytime soon, so that's why I wanted to get two bags, that way I don't have to worry about it for a while, and it's a good done deal. This is five pounds each, so we have 10 pounds. Cookies and cream, ice cream, this is much cheaper than going to like the ice cream place and such everybody likes this very easy to just have at home chips these are for nachos we love having nachos and this is strictly what we use these chips for taco nachos delicious super easy fast meal highly recommend pickles Zach loves these pickles for a snack. How to get those for him. Go-Go Squeezes for Savannah's lunch. We've been out of these for a while and I forgot to get them the last time. So we have these 32 of those. And then I also have go for her lunches. She's been asking. Plus these were on sale. These were only $4 for 32 of them. Very exciting. Zach likes these too so he can pack these for lunch for work. 10 pound bag of potatoes. So I have a little story for you guys. Zach's gonna be so annoyed by this story. Uh, okay, so I had a 10 pound bag of potatoes. You might have seen in a haul I got from, I think Walmart maybe it was, or it was Sam's, I can't remember. But I had a 10 pound bag and I used two of the potatoes for you know um, wedges and stuff that I made. And there were two potatoes in there that were bad. And so, you know, let me know what you would do in the comments. So normally, if there's two bad potatoes, you just throw them out and then you can eat the rest because you wash them or sometimes you skin them. Depends how you like your potatoes, okay? It's the same thing with strawberries. If there are two bad strawberries, do you throw all the strawberries out or just the two bad ones? So me personally, I would just throw the two bad ones out. Zach threw away a three quarters of the way full potato bag. And uh, yeah, so anyways, we have a bag of potatoes. I just wanna know, what would you guys do? Would you just throw the two bad ones away or the whole bag away? I had no idea he threw the whole bag away till the next day when I went to go make dinner and I needed potatoes. And I called him and I was like, hey, what did you do with the bag of potatoes? And he's like, oh, I threw them out. Oh my gosh, <laughs> I can't. Uh, Anyways, moving on, we have Little Bites muffins. I wanted to get these because soon we're gonna be having t-ball practice for both kids. And this is a great quick snack for Navy and for the kids, and then also just good to have on hand in general. Like I do make homemade muffins, but these are just really nice because you can bring them back and you're good to go, an extra different snack. Cheez-Its, we already had a pop open because Navy wanted some Cheez-Its. She loves the Cheez-Its, Zach does. Savannah takes them for snack for school sometimes, so Cheez-Its are a must-have in my house with snack. Four pound bag of apples. We love the Honeycrisp apples. These were actually a pretty good price. How to get them. String cheese, these are great for packing lunches and for Zach's lunch as well. And just a quick little snack too. If you're on a weight loss journey and you just need like a little snack, you want something, just rip this and eat it and eat it very slowly and it's very fulfilling, so. Very good. We have blueberries. I'm gonna make blueberry muffins, but also Navy likes blueberries, so I got some blueberries. Savannah does too, I can put these in her lunch. But we have blueberries for blueberry muffins. I'm so excited to make homemade chicken salad. If you are a long time subscriber, you know that when I started my first weight loss journey in 2022, I got this and I would have like a chicken salad half, like one piece of bread, put chicken salad on half of it and then fold it over. This was great for protein. And so I really wanna get back into this again, like less bread in my meals. Like I love peanut butter and jellies, but two pieces of bread is just, it's just too much for me. And so I got this. Zach will also eat some chicken salad sandwiches. So it's a win-win with lunches for us. 
tortillas, of course, for tacos, for chicken enchiladas, for Zach's cheesy wraps. All the good things. And lastly, two pounds of strawberries. Lately, the strawberries haven't been the best from here. So we're going to see what these are like before I make my Walmart order, if I need to order more or not. Uh, but we love strawberries. We go through a two-pound thing of strawberries in probably 48 hours because my kids love strawberries so much. Like, I wish I could grow strawberries <laughs> at my house because that would save me so much money. They love strawberries, you guys. My kids are obsessed. We probably go through four pounds of strawberries at least a week, sometimes six. It just depends. Uh, sometimes I gotta like slow the roll on them because it's expensive. Like I love that they love fruit, but holy crap, expensive. Uh, but this is everything that I got from Sam's Club. I will go ahead and put the total at the bottom. And I also got gas while I was there too because you know, you get a discount there. You pay for the membership. You might as well. I think gas was like $33 and I had less than a half a tank. This is what I got from Sam's Club and my total next we will see you with the Walmart haul. Okay, I just got back from Walmart and here it is. Now this is kind of small, I guess I would say, because we are really dialing it in on the grocery budget. Grocery budget has been insane the last couple months. Uh, this is crooked, I apologize. Uh, grocery budget has been insane the last two months because of January, we had Xavier that was born and then Savannah's birthday, February, Navy's birthday. And so things have been kind of off a little bit, I feel like, and we're kind of trying to find like a groove with the diapers and wipes and such. Anyways, so this is a smaller haul combined with the Sam's Club from yesterday. And so the budget was $300 and we are just below that, which is amazing. And hopefully that works out for us. Uh, I'm gonna share with you guys what we got though at Walmart and share the total of this haul at the end. I just realized if you did the math from like the last haul and this one, you'll realize kind of how much this one is. But anyways, three bags of broccoli. We've been having broccoli as a side, steamed broccoli. It's really good if you're having like shrimp or chicken, anything like that. It's really nice to have and it's healthy. I think we already have one or two, but I wanted to stock up a little bit. Corn, we got two pounds and two pounds, so four pounds. Reason being is because I am making a dish for Easter tomorrow at my in-laws and it's called the best corn ever. No, seriously, like that's what the dish is called. It's really good, it's unhealthy for you, but it's delicious. And so I do a double batch, so then we have some extra leftover and just so then there's enough for everybody. So we've got that. Strawberry yogurt and strawberry banana. I know you guys are like, oh my gosh, these people have Danimals, go -Gurt now this savannah really likes these she also likes the cooker and the other animals uh just to kind of mix it up a little bit we got these uh i forgot to take these out of the bag but we have two loaves of bread i will go ahead and freeze these we have sandwiches a lot you guys already know 60 eggs love my eggs we have them for breakfast every morning savannah has them for breakfast too sometimes like this morning and so there we go, 60 eggs. Two bags of avocados. I love my avocados every day. I love to have one at lunchtime, and Navy has some of mine, or sometimes her own avocado. Absolutely delicious. Four cucumbers. These are to slice up. We love these as a snack. Navy, in particular, my two-year-old loves these for a snack or for as a side for breakfast. Three things of cinnamon rolls. Uh, I think it was I buy three, and I get like $2 Walmart cash or something, so that's why I got three of them. And we like to have these on the weekends. The kids really enjoy these and I'm actually gonna make it into like a little bunny. For Easter, I thought it was really cute. Like I saw it on Pinterest. Uh, you just like take the edge of it and you like make it into like a bunny. So I'm gonna try that. Maybe it'll work out. Fingers crossed it does because that would be so adorable. Three 2% milks. Oh, this one expires on my birthday. Uh, random. But we have these three milks. What stinks about this is that these will expire right before the eclipse, which I'll have to talk to you guys about in another video, but it's gonna like pass by us where we live at in Ohio. And so I'm gonna have to get milk like a whole week before, even if these aren't gone or aren't expired yet, just because it's gonna be crazy here probably with that. Two unsweet silk almond vanilla almond milks and need to have those salt we were completely out of salt and i don't know why this is doing that it's really annoying me i'm about to just rip it off because that kind of really bothers me uh taco bell chipotle creamy sauce my husband loves that 
the Blue Diamond Whole Natural Almonds for myself. Love them. That's a great healthy snack in between lunch and dinner after I work out. Two bags of milk chocolate chips. You guys know I love to bake muffins and cookies homemade from scratch. So we have that. And another two pound thing of strawberries because my kids are eating the ones from Sam's Club like crazy. And I knew I was going to need another one. So here we are. Another two pound container of strawberries. This is everything that I got from Sam from Sam's Club. Oh my gosh. This is everything that I got from Walmart. Uh, there was one thing unavailable. It was margarine, which I have enough to make this recipe, so it's fine. But this is everything that I got from Walmart. I believe my total was originally when before they had everything it was like 95, but it ended up being like $90, I think. I'll put it down below. But that is everything that I got from both Sam's Club and Walmart. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video and if you did please be sure to give it a huge thumbs up subscribe if you guys would like to see more and i'll see you in my next video